What's going on everybody? Drake Bell here. <clears throat> Drake Bell here with another video. Today is going to be a different kind of a video. Tonight we got a uh, Patrick Blake Racing. He's got he builds Supras like these guys right behind me. This is what he builds Mark 4s specifically and B58 or sorry. Whoops. Anything to Jay-Z. So tonight <clears throat> he just got done building a badass Mark 4. So we're going to get a bunch of dyno pulls for you guys and some two step and flames and whatnot. Um, maybe even a little little tag along flyby action for you guys. We'll see if he takes us on a ride along. We're expecting to hit 1400 wheel, maybe 1500. Last night they were on the dyno and I'll put a video here. <laughs> from that dyno run he made like 1380 on the wheel to the wheels and uh one of his tires had a splice in it so uh, they had to get a new tire today and now they're gonna be back on the dyno and they made an exhaust for it so gonna get that action for you guys let's get started gordy <whistles> gordy come here come here come here come here come here sit sit hey shake shake good boy good boy good boy what's up hey gordy gordy where'd it go Where'd it go? Oh. oh, get off my seat, son. Oh, he, oh, he actually bit the phone. <laughs> Boy, what the hell? Hey, he got that merch on, though. Turn around. Yeah, I got that Drake Bell hoodie. Link in bio. As you guys already saw in the intro, that's the Red Super on the dyno tonight, shooting flames. Um, I'll add the clip of the flames in from last night too in this video. I'll just insert it here. We're about to get started with this little dino sesh. We're locking up our shop and then uh, walking to his dino room and just gonna film it for you guys. There is a race tonight, Trevor's RS3 versus a Hellcat, but um, I kind of want to get this content instead. The racing here has been a little dry the last week, but this content's a little different. I do kind of, kind of excited to film this instead. So um, let me know if you guys like it or not. We'll probably. Film some more videos of his supers that he's built. This is my shop. You got a little Grand Sport in here. Twin Turbo 5.0. This is powers you've seen on the channel. His bumper's all fucked up. We've got Mustang James Mustang in here. He blew his engine, so we're building him an engine. Mr. Kool-Aid B58. You've seen him on the channel with some races. He broke an axle, so we're doing that for him. Then we got my Mustang. It looks a little different since the last time I showed you. <laughs> right now, it's just a fucking... It's just a shelf just because uh, I've been doing my carbon doors and shit. So I just did my carbon my carbon cowl hood, my carbon fenders, and then uh, I also did my carbon trunk. And uh, today, or sorry, yesterday, I did my carbon door on this side. Just got started on it. And it was fitting like dog shit here. It kept hitting. So I had to do a lot of grinding and stuff, but check it out. Look how easy it opens. And then put this down. Let me show you how easily it closes. Just like that, like super nice. Well, I made it super nice. And then I got a bunch of crap in here. Those are my stock headers from this piece of crap. The carbon wheel, it's just a pile right now. Oh, check it out. My intercooler came in for my turbo kit. It's like a six inch or something. It's the size of my palm almost, my hand. That's a big boy right here. This intercooler is heavy as fuck, but it's gonna be making some power, so we need that. I already finished paying for my Motec. That ran me like 11 grand for the Motec and harness. And then um, now I just need to get my TH400 through the tube front and cage. I got my parachute bracket and everything. So we're getting closer and closer to drive the car and build it the rest of the way and tune it and everything. Um, haven't fully decided what turbo I'm going with. I don't know what size. I might even do a four link in the rear rather than IRS. Um, Right now the car's in pieces, so I have all these options in my mind. So I don't know what the fuck I'm doing with it right now. But um, yeah, I just want to give you guys a little update. In my showroom, I've got, I'm trying to build the wall of the cars we work on. So there's a Gen 3 cover, Gen 2, has a GTR. So primarily we build Mustangs, um, Camaros, Corvettes, and Mopars. But we also have done <clears throat> some GTR work. Um, I don't know if I want to film shop content or not, but we'll see. We'll see, it might come in the future. Mister, it's just a six car. My little snap on fucking change jar. What do you guys think? Should we drop some, some shop content down for you guys on the channel? You let me know. I might just have to, it'd be good, good content, good content. 
Also, my merch is in stock, so go get your hoodie, your shirt, decals, drakeboatperformance.com. I'll put the link in the description below. I'm also gonna be coming out with some shorts soon because summer's right around the corner and other designs like tank tops or whatever else. So um, yeah, look forward to more, more stuff on the website. Look at these CCWs. Super crankshaft. He has probably the best racing sim I've seen in the shop. He just made this shit for shits and giggles and it's dope. He had an exhaust on it, but he took it off. Mr. Gordy. One of the cleanest dino rooms I've ever seen. All white epoxy, white walls. Big boy turbo. Precision turbo. What are your predictions? New Supra here. Uh, we touching 1500? Huh? We touching 1500? Touching 1500 like a priest touches a kid. <laughs> Look at his monitor. <laughs> For the dyno. Stand next to it for comparison. I'm 6'4", by the way. 6'4". Size of my meat. Let's see, play some Fortnite. Play some Minecraft. <laughs> A work of art, man. Patrick knows how to build these cars. So this is where they left off yesterday. 1357 and 958. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? Whoa. I take it back. This is the Dino Graph. I made just over 200. Just over. Oh. When you bust these out, you already know what it is, son. So whenever he honks, that's the signal to get out of the room or stay back and record. So I'm gonna get the fire up right here and then as soon as he honks, I'm gonna move. It's about to get loud with these fans on. So it's gonna be just loud in general in this room. So just be ready for that.
in the trunk. Just look at the cage set up. I'm pretty sure after the dyno session is done, they're gonna pull it out here and do some pops and bangs for you guys. That bitch is on there tight. Gotta hold down all 20,000 horsepower of this bitch. <laughs> Why did you look so mad? <laughs> right now.
You need those earplugs, man. Got a new cameraman in town. Whoa, 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 Buster. Whoa, Buster. power okay you can't even hear the car in the game All right, that shit was crazy.
laughing in there. Is that it? That's it. 14 14 to finish the night. A little bit out of the overflow, another crazy. Oh my gosh, dude. 14 14 to end the little, night. It pushed a little cooling on that last hit, right? It's okay. It just came out of the overflow tank. I don't even know how you read that. Huh? I said, I don't even know how you read that. <laughs> he doesn't. That's not my guess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 52 pounds? Yeah. 52.9. Oh my god, look it. The car's been off for over two minutes and the turbo's still spooling down. Fifty three 53 pounds boost. Look at this guy looking like he's knowing what he's doing. I'm trying to get the number. Dang it. That's as close as it's going to be. We're going to get one pop and bang for you guys. And then they're going to put it on the lift and build the, the rest of the exhaust for it. And then this shit gets picked up tomorrow. Ten minutes later, cars on the lift, getting the rest of the exhaust made. Damn. 
aluminum. That's the builder. Were you guys running just out of the downpipe today? Yeah. Yeah. God damn, is that the wastegate? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, yeah. that thing's huge. This is the This is five inch? Oh, that's the dump? Yeah, it just feels like that. That's sick, huh? So this is one of LJ's Mark IVs, which is still <laughs> Mark IV, um, but it's NA, and we're taking bets on how much it's gonna make. I said 114 wheel, and he marked down everybody's guess on it. I'm sticking a 114 wheel. It's got headers and exhaust, but <laughs> that ain't much. And it's right-hand drive. <laughs> Look at what I bought for shits and giggles. A little fucking hoverboard. What is it, Gordy? Don't fuck with me, son. Don't fuck with me, son. Oh, he's pissed. <laughs> ah. 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 <laughs> he's pissed. Leave the hood closed. <laughs> Does it really need the fan? <laughs> Yeah, pop that sucker out. Woo! Filter from the 90s, son. That's filthy. Pulling the filter off. We're going to put a... I have some nitrous. Throw it in the intake. Which, which plug wire is it? Which one is what? I can go by gear ratio, but I think we can also go by... Uh, we can go by spark plug. Which one are you looking for? Number yeah. one. Um, I see it's a big wire. This has 3,000 uh, horsepower. We can do it by gear ratio. Has a bottom mount turbo kit. That way you can't see it, right? It's got an air to water and cooler, so there's no front mount. Air to water? Yeah. Hey, look at this. Look at this. That's the turbo right there. That's the turbo? Yeah. The weight rating on this thing is only 160 pounds, and I already feel the wheel giving out. Oh, buddy. Oh. Listen to this baby purr. It's funny because it still sounds like a Supra, just not all that aggressive. Heart underwear. I said 114, everybody else was 129 or above, so let's see how much it makes. And it's an automatic, it's not stick shift. It downshifted on its own. <laughs> Bro. Look at him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 
Look at that power curve. <laughs> you like your power curve? Not too bad, huh? <laughs> He's gonna do another one. It looks like it, but it's an arrow. What? An edge? It like rusts? Oh, okay, okay. Two straps. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's why I was laughing. It only has two. <laughs> That's not bad. 200. A little heat soak. That's all she's got. <laughs> That's all she's got. <laughs> we gotta put a fan in Let's put the fan on the intake. <laughs> he said, go ahead. Go put on the intake. <laughs> He's gonna use the fan as a ghetto turbo. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. No. <laughs> Lifted the head naturally. Well, I guess forced induction. <laughs> Consistently losing power. That's what it's consistent at. First gear hit. Hey, turn on your fan. Forced induction. I'm not running this thing in fourth gear. Hell, that's a... That's a He's gonna do a hit in second gear. Try to make more. And it smells like 87 octane. He's gonna do one last pull in first gear. Really see what she makes now. He said it didn't actually make 409 torque. It just goes based off RPM, so it lied to him. Damn, this thing eats, bro. She's nasty. 2,110 horsepower? Oh my god. Dang. That made so much power, it broke the dyno. It's just not reading right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's spinning. It's, yeah, it's spinning 100%. Let's sit him in the trunk again. All right, guys. Well, that's going to conclude this video. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Um, let me know if you want some more Supra content because he's always got some badass builds going on with the dyno and everything else. So, I mean, I'd love to show you stuff like that. Also, big shout out to Patrick from Patrick Blake Racing. It's PBR, PBR underscore, shit, PBR underscore.
underscore Supra on Instagram. Check out his page and all the stuff that he's got going on in his shop. And if you have a Mark IV that you want to make fast as fuck, send him a DM. Other than that, um, I'm going to end the video here. So, again, like, subscribe. My Amada squad, you know who you are. Thanks for sticking around, and I'll catch you in the next one. Deuces.